Hello everyone. In this video, let us solve one question that involves the concept of maxima and minima. Suppose y minus x is equal to 10. What is the value of x square y when y cube minus x cube is minimum? So given that y minus x is 10, it is same as saying y is equal to x plus 10. So let, let this be equation 1. Let us substitute x plus 10 in place of y in y cube minus x cube. x plus that will become x plus 10 whole cube minus x cube which is a function of x. So let us represent it as f of x. And let us expand this. We get x cube plus 30 x square plus 300 x plus 1000 and minus x cube. So this x cube and minus x cube gets cancelled and we will be left with 30 x square plus 300 x plus 1000 which is f of x. So for this function f of x, if we calculate f dash of x and equate it to 0, we will get the critical points of f of x. So f dash of x will be, this will be 2 times 30 x. 300. So we will equate it to 0, we get 60x plus 300 is equal to 0, x is equal to minus 300 by 60, which is minus 5. So we got x is equal to minus 5 as the critical point. Now, to check whether this critical point is maxima or minima, we will check the sign of f double dash of x at this point. So, f double dash of x will be 60. So, f dash of x is 60 x plus 300. If you have again differentiate with x, we will get 60, which is greater than 0. So, recall the properties of local minima and local maxima. So, if our f double dash of x is greater than 0, then it is local minima. So, which implies x is equals to minus 5 is a local minima. If it is less than 0, then it would have been a local maximum. So finally, we got that at x is equal to minus 5, this function f of x attains minimum value. Luckily, that is what we require to find. Now, as we got the value of x as minus 5, substitute that value in this equation 1. Then we will get the value of y. So y is equal to minus 5 plus 10 which is equal to 5. Hence, we got the value of uh, x as minus 5 and y as 5. Then we can compute the value of x square y. Therefore, x square y will be minus 5 square and y is 5. So, this will be 25 times 5 which is 125. Thank you.